Here with the fabulous panorama, one of the most glamorous and exciting achievements in the commercial retail world, the local mall, all of life's social rights of passage take place. Your first paycheck, your first kiss, open your brand new business, all of it happens. Say my name. Say my name. <laughs> Des 
man. Yeah, say in Italian now. I don't know Italian. Well, say hey, something. Okay, go ahead. You gonna yeah. talk to me? You gonna talk to me? You gonna butt chest with me? You know, I, I was gonna try and do this on the down low so you wouldn't have to know that it was me as backstabbing you, but I know. I found the, I found pictures oh, of the mall and schematics, <laughs> and I know that you know. Well, what the hell are you talking about? Pictures and schematics in the mall? Everybody's got those. My grandmother had pictures and schematics in the mall. <laughs> really? Brad, listen to me, okay? Have a seat on this tree stump. We're gonna talk. <laughs> <laughs> what you gotta understand is I'm here looking out for you, okay? You go over there and talk to Mr. Poop, whatever his name is. M Mr. Pip. Mr. Poopo Pip's pants, poopy pants, <laughs> pie pie. I don't care, Bradley. He's a nothing. I am your future. You understand that? Look at me and you say, you renounce your father, you renounce your family, you love Devin Westfield. Say it. You don't say it, you know what I'm going to do? <laughs> well, let's just say that little boy that you found in that mall underneath that car, right? The first child I killed, Bradley. You think about that. Get out of my way, squirrel!
vermin. Is that a cockroach? He brought that. He brought that in, that slimy bastard. Okay. All right.
it when you kind of accosted me. That's right. I got your stomach pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so, but maybe. <laughs> Do you come in for hair or fist then? Uh, hair. I've been fired from my job, Sebastian. I was fired, and then I went to Denton and Westfield and I asked him for a job on a horrible person. You were fired from the Westfield movie? <laughs> no, I was fired from the gallery. I went to Desmond Westfield. Desmond Westfield? I know! <laughs> There's a story about him and me. <laughs> Thank you. 
destroy me if I left. But if cat and pick and nut or mutter, if that's something <laughs> that I gotta do for you, then, then I'll do it. I'll tell him it's over, I'm done. Because I'm in love with a girl. And all I wanna do is hold your hand. Hey! Hope you don't mind, I use a service here. <laughs> Couldn't help overhearing what you were saying, but come back now, Brad. I'm your friend. Come close here. Don't oh. touch him. Don't Gilly. worry, I'll, I'll protect him. Oh, Jenny Gilly, you're gonna protect him. Just like you protected yourself last time I slapped you in the face. Now. You know what? She just... I've been doing kickboxing, so bring it on, Desi. Kickboxing ain't faster than this, Jenny Ted! <laughs> for man on man kiss for below. <laughs> and what did he do? And he slapped me in the face, called me bisexual, and I had to go and break free. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sebastian, that's terrible. It's okay, kiddo. <laughs> You're not a bisexual, I don't think. It's, it's actually, yes, it's very <laughs> <laughs> I like the pole and the pole. <laughs> well, I'm sure Jesus will forgive you for your hole and hole. Which do you prefer? A pole or a hole? <laughs> oh, dear. Wow. No one's ever asked me that before, but a pole, definitely. <laughs> 
December walks in. Well, you better tell me. 
Or else I'm going to give you a half cup that you don't like so much. Maybe I'll send you a little color here. Cut. How do you feel about that? Oh, my God. That's a thing worse than hell. Tell me what he's turned that deal. Oh, God. He, he's, he's bisexual, but you know that already. Tell me your name. He, he Tell me your name. <laughs> Yeah. 
on, cheerleaders? Yeah, like that's what he's into or something. God, for a minute I thought you were going to tell me something totally revealing about yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Carl was finally doing whatever it was he was doing in the dressing room. And he comes out to see Desmond Westfield there. Not to sleep it off. Just look into the camera when you're sad and smile. Oh, Desmond. Carl. Please. Over here. I have something for you. Oh, really? Yes. Is it a family camera soup? No, a camera with all the bad secrets of this mall. You want it? Well, Carl, you know I do. What are you, uh, what are you in a mood for? What are you bargaining a wheel for? Wheel. The small is going to go under, and you know that is for sure. Maybe wanting to secure some. Something about herself instead of other people, and what will become of Wally and his son? Will they find love? 